Got your back against the wall, no, you know you never had a chance. Should've known better, now you better make other players. There's no going back, gotta let you know in advance. This is Game Squad. Coming at y'all with an updated deck profile for the post of list since it was dropped today. And I just wanted to give some shit all players a little hope since uh, our beautiful construct got banned and sent to heaven with all of our other friends, like the Fall Chain. And uh, Uriel's been kind of sad, and I know he's not going to give up on the dream, so I, I guess I would give him a little hope and give, show him a little deck profile right here with his construct, I mean, with this uh, Shaganaga that I still haven't gave him yet, the misprint. Uh, here we go, it's the Earth Shit Alls, it's a stun build for post the list. All right, we got three Shaganaga. Obviously, this is our win con or our fusion. We can just keep going into and trying to abuse. It's just trap to travel nightmare on, in a, on a card, basically, but it doesn't have to be during the summon, turn of summon. And this card's just really good, and it's, it's a big monster. All right, win con, uh, other win con, Winda, but she's not as good right now, but she probably will be better in the near future when uh, MM comes out. Uh, one Garista, negates Pendulum. It's, it still can negate Pendulum Summons unless it's changed its ruling. See, now, this, it's only going to be to do with a Pendulum Summon 1, so I guess it's not as good against the Cleavers as it used to be. Uh, but it's still a good card, and we can make it with the core. It's just an extra fusion we can make. Probably we'll play three window, but I just don't have one at the moment, and it's probably not really necessary. Uh, two Norton. It's just one of our other win cons we can make a rank force with, such as Castell, Dweller, uh, Crab King, and Emerald. Uh, this is just going to help with recycle and synchros, as you see. Kind of doing deck profile backwards because I wanted to show you all some stuff we can do. It's basic extra deck stuff, and that's. Basically, our win cons, but the deck is really gr grindy and it's going to be a stun base, so the extra deck's not as important in some situations besides the fusions. Uh, the, to the main deck, we got three Skamata, consistency, helps us dump what we need at the moment, and sometimes we need to dump our L so we can get it back with one of our fusions, so we can still get our one L. Uh, three Hedgehog, we need a monster in our hand to discard for uh, Shigenaga effect, and it also helps us start up fusions. Uh, two Falco. Kind of playing both of sub to three, but it's recyclable with Emerald. Uh, two Beast, draw power. Three is not necessary. It's really not. Unless, we, because we're not in a mirror format. Two Dragon, the back row is going to be more relevant when the next when the next set comes out, and Bosch. So, it's just really good. And it bounces things. Uh, the Splash, three Mermelio, one of my favorite cards, as everybody knows. Uh, this is just going to start our time space and mo in most situations because it's going to be really good next format. Uh, this is a, a plus one, it just helps out with all the back row cards we play. And this card's at one now, so we can only have one math man, it's another target, obviously, so it helps. So we need another card that can dump, which is Armageddon Knight, which is also searchable by a card that we play at one as well, because it's at one now. Uh, Global, uh, just splashable for the synchros, and it also is just too powerful whenever you go into Nanatari Beast with Marelio. Uh, we got two maxi, just drop power, need some consistency. And it's earth. Now it down some spells. Three, shoot off fusion, max out on this one, and one L. I really don't want to play Neth, but it's probably an option but, or polymerization. But this card just really good, so we need to dump it with our few other cards we play. Uh, two instant fusion for Nodens and Winda. Uh, Reinforcement army for the Armageddon Knights. Foolish. And we're gonna keep first place. Alright, down to traps, play 10. Uh, three Shadow Games, just a combo card. Helps us search and dig and draw. Uh, one core. Complain and bumping that up too because we need to recycle our fusions. And it's another target to fuse with. Uh, two Time Space, just really good in the next coming minute with, with uh, Cosmos and uh, Match Fed to come out. And oh, it stops Pendulum Suns basically. Uh, bottomless, another searchable target, and Nightmare Home. Some effects are kind of aggravating, so this will stop it. And Break the Seal is not as good when the new set comes out, really. Uh, emptiness, too good. Warning. Pendulum Summons. That's it for the main deck, 40 cards. Uh, three Space Typhoon. Pendulums, really good. Uh, three Mistake, just anti meta card. Pendulums for anti spell fragments, we're going to stop them from being able to set their scales. And their cross is not around anymore, so this card would be good against them, but I don't really need it for them anymore. It's not relevant. Uh, two Iron Wall for Cosmos, and two Lightmere for Cosmos, and this also stops Infernoids, which is also going to be a pain in the ass. And this is just mostly what it's for.
but it also starts Teller Knights, which is also an aggravated matchup. Red skill for whenever the side of Majesty scene, so like that. Uh, depends on what deck we're playing against. It just helps against Rogue matchup as well. And the one Nightmare Hole just gets on the side in the second one. That's it for the, the deck, and this is basically going to be the new construct for us, but it's also with the band card towers, obviously. And that's it for the profile, and thanks for watching, and thanks for letting Joe share this on his page, and please subscribe. Please stay connected with me by adding me on all my social networks on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Just copy the link into your search bar and add. Thank you.